Good morning. Hey, Gabe. Good morning. No, we say aloha. Oh, aloha. Uh, okay. So listen, I'm, I'm meeting Deuce for the first time here today, folks. Deuce, where are you headed uh, in August? Which island exactly? I'm going to Kauai. Uh, on the Hawaiian island chain. Will you be headed to? Kauai. Uh, Kauai, yes. lush green. You're an outdoorsman. You like the kayaking in the river. You like the rappelling off those beautiful cliffs there. Uh, you're, a, you're an active man. I am an uh, active man. I, I picture Camby as... As more of like the 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 luxury dining, uh, the luxury shopping, the uh, relaxing <laughs> on the beach with celebrities. So I want to send Camby to Wailea. Now Wailea is on the south, southwestern shores of Maui, uh, and this has become my favorite destination. Uh, you know, in all of the uh, that beautiful chain of Hawaiian islands. Uh, temperatures here tend to just stay in the 70s and 80s all year long. Less rain on this portion of Maui than uh, other portions like Kanapali. Uh, this is where the Four Seasons and the Fairmont Kailana and the Grand Wailea attract those celebrities all year round, right? Uh, but there's a, a condo complex here called the Wailea Ekahi Village, which is all, right on the water on 34 acres, and it allows you to get, you know, sort of kiss that Wailea experience, but not having to spend the big bucks with some of these uh, beautiful luxury resorts, right? A uh, one-bedroom condo here, 179 a night, uh, can be. Okay. Uh, and this is for travel August through mid-December, which is a great time to go. After the summer rush, temperatures are so great, crowds are thinner. The beaches are all to yourselves uh, there, and uh, the condos come equipped with like a private lanai. You got a washer dryer, the fully equipped kitchen there, so you can cook your, your coconut chicken there by the end of the day, and then uh, enjoy some mai tais on your private lanai. Uh, so that's the Wailea Ekahi Village. Can I be honest with you? I'm actually eyeing this as a place for me and my family to go to in November. Perfect. So I might see you there, Candy. I'll, I'll go the in November. It's great. I'm going to send you my travel dates just, just, just in case. Okay? Um, let's talk about Southern California. If you're looking for a, a, a summer getaway to Southern California, I got a couple of options for you. The first one here is in beautiful Beverly Hills. If you want to go shopping on Rodeo Drive, this place is literally like a two minute walk from Rodeo Drive, just off Wilshire Boulevard. All that great uh, celebrity shopping and dining and glitz. Uh, the Mosaic Beverly Hills. Spend the night here for $1.99 a night. This is a, just a great boutique four star hotel there in the heart of Beverly Hills. Uh, great for a big city LA getaway. Now, if you want to go inland a little bit, enjoy some of the savings we're seeing in the Southern California deserts. This is where you want to stay the JW Marriott Desert Springs Resort and Spa. It's in Palm Desert, about 50 minutes from El Paseo Shopping in Palm Springs proper. But this is a beautiful, sprawling four diamond property, two golf courses here. Five pools, six restaurants, and what I love, 23 acres of Venetian inspired waterways. So you can actually get around on this property uh, on a gondola uh, as you head toward golf, maybe, or you head toward the spa. Uh, this is just a beautiful uh, property, especially when you can spend just $129 a night to spend the night here all summer long through Labor Day weekend. Temperatures go up in the desert, so prices come down. It's just the way that it works. You do all your uh, rigorous activity. In the mornings and in the evenings, and then you're inside in the spa or shopping or, or eating uh, the rest of the day. And if you want to do a little drivable getaway, just fill the gas tank and not have to go all that far away to get away. Uh, two of my favorite destinations here. First in Mendocino. This is the Hills, Hill House Inn. Uh, if you're a fan of a show called, you may be too young for this, called Murder, She Wrote with Angela <laughs> Lansbury. This area and this inn was featured pretty prominently in a lot of those shows. Uh, you can spend a, a night there, perhaps play sleuth all your own, uh, for $79 a night. $79 bucks for travel throughout the summer season. You even get a bottle of wine when you check in. And if you want to go to San Jose, perhaps for, vi for business or pleasure, uh, no better property there than the Fairmont, San Jose, Four Diamond property. Uh, great dining on site here. U.S. presidents and celebrities have stayed here, but I bet they didn't pay 149 bucks a night with valet parking when they went. But because we're friends here, that's how much you get to pay. Anyway, all of these uh, deals at the TravelZoo.com website. Uh, and I'll, I'll be tweeting some of these deals out here in just a little bit, Camby. So, okay, uh, perfect. Uh, I'll tag you, okay? Okay, yes, thank you. And thanks for letting me just jump on both of your guys' vacations. <laughs> I appreciate it. Hey. <laughs>